हे एवरीबडी दिस इज दीपक खतीर फ्रॉम अपसेडाउन लैब्स इन अ प्रीवियस वीडियो वी शोड यू हाउ टू यूज बैकयार्ड ब्रेन स्पाइक रिकॉर्डर इन कंजंक्शन विद ऑडिनो ओनो एंड बायो एम बी एच जी पिल टू रिकॉर्ड योर बायो पोटेंशियल सिग्नल्स यू कैन क्लिक ऑन दिस कार्ड टू सी दैट वीडियो इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू यूज ब्रेन बे विच इज एन ओपन सोर्स बायो सिग्नल प्रोजेक्ट टू क्रिएट बायो फीडबैक एंड न्यूरो फीडबैक एप्लीकेशन नाउ विदाउट फर्दर डू लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट To make things easy for you, we have created this repository called Brain Bay BioAmp, which includes simple to follow instructions and all the firmware you are going to need for your Arduino and a simple experiment that you can use to record four bio potential signals using four channels of your Arduino Uno. To get the code and the instructions, just click on this code button and download everything as a zip. Provide a folder and save all the files. Beside the code available in the repository, you will need BrainBay itself, and I hope you already have Arduino Uno and Arduino IDE with you. Go to the instructions, and you will find the instruction to download the BrainBay. Click on this link; it will lead you to this page. Now you have to click on this setup BrainBay dot exe to download BrainBay. Just provide a folder and execute it. At this stage you have downloaded everything that is required to do the experiment. Now you have to install BrainBay and unzip all the files from the repository you just downloaded from the GitHub. Do that and let's catch up in the next section. To install BrainBay, click on this setup BrainBay file. Say yes. I agree. Next install. And this will be installed in no time. Close this. Click on BrainBay BioAmp main repository file. Right click extract all you can extract all in the same location i have already extracted all the files just double click on the folder now go to shield ekg emg demo click on this shield ekg emg demo arduino sketch make sure your arduino is connected properly click on tools select the correct com port for your arduino now click on this upload button while this is uploading Let's open up BrainBay. Using this sketch, you can record up to six channels of bio potential data at two fifty six hertz sampling rate. Now, to start the experiment, click on Design, Load Design, and go to the repository which we just downloaded from the GitHub. For us, it is in Documents and Arduino. go to experiment folder and click on exg con for some laptops the fft might not work as it is working right now to connect the arduino to our brain bay click on this show design right click on this eeg source make sure the correct com port is selected for us this is com3 baud rate is 57600 which is correct Now click on this connect disconnect button. As you can see, the device is connected now, and you will see a blinking LED on Maker Uno if you are using that. Else, for Arduino Uno, you can connect an LED to pin number nine to see the blinking pattern of the LED. Now we just hide the design and click on play. If everything is done right, you will be able. to see the bio potential signals on to the oscilloscope and a fft graph on the side for some reason three of the fft graphs are not uh, updating properly this is because of some processing error and computational intensive task we don't really need the fft graph 3d fft graph for simple applications so what you can do show design click on fft and delete all the fft's now we are left with just the bio potential signals on our oscilloscope if you want to increase this for all the six channels click on show design now let's say if you want to use raw signal from channel 5 
and we want to visualize it on the oscilloscope we will connect channel 5 to the channel 5 of our oscilloscope and channel 5 will be shown on the screen like this but we have not connected anything to the channel 5 of Arduino Uno so this will just be some signal that is either passing through from other channels as a noise or just the environmental noise so that was all for this video i hope the video was informative if you have any question just put your question in the comment section below until then stay safe have a good one peace